Hey everyone and welcome back to another video from CryptoBusy. My name is Tom. Now in today's video we're going to go through Algorand, the latest updates it has to offer and why I think it's going to take 2023 by storm and beyond. Now first of all I'm not a financial advisor, this is not financial advice um, and secondly this is not sponsored. I generally love Algorand and what it has to offer and also going through the latest updates, how you could participate yourselves and again this whole project overall. Some really exciting updates I want to go through with you guys in today's video. So with that all being said, my name is Tom. This is Crypto Busy. If you're new here and you want to see more videos like this, be sure to join the Crypto Busy family today and subscribe. And if you like the video, make sure to leave a like. It's very much appreciated. And do comment down below your thoughts and opinions. It's also very much appreciated as well. Whether you're holding Algorand or not, do also comment down below your thoughts and opinions that we're going to go through in today's video. So currently, Algorand is trading at around 17 cents. Its all-time high on its market open was around sort of $3.20. But let's just sort of take that out for a second if we have a look at the all-time high from 2021 it was around sort of two dollars 20 nearly two dollars 30 so it has the ability in my opinion to go back up to its all-time high but not anytime soon it's not going to happen you know this week or even next month or even most of next year in my opinion i think in terms of its price action I think that's where we're going to be seeing the price action go positively at around 2024. But in terms of taking 2023 by storm, I think in terms of the partnerships that Algorand is getting into and also the network development, these are some really exciting opportunities where I think Algorand could inch its way back up into sort of the top 30, into the top 20, and potentially even into the top 15. It's a really interesting project. So you may be asking, what is Algorand? And some people call it the Ethereum killer. I personally don't like the idea of the thing called an Ethereum killer. Um, you know, it's good to coexist in this space and have that competition. But at the end of the day, Ethereum is the king of the altcoins so far. And every project is unique in and of itself. So when you hear the term Ethereum killer, just put that to a side for a second. And let's talk about what Algorand is doing. So Algorand is a bit like Ethereum. You can build smart contracts on there. Um, and also it does have you know similar abilities to what Ethereum can do. But in terms of its tokenomics, that's where it separates itself uh, from other uh, projects. So it has a fixed supply of about 10 billion algo, which were minted at uh, Genesis. And then these tokens will be distributed until around 2030, um, following the long term allocations. So this is very similar to what Bitcoin's um, uh, tokenomics are like. The similar with also XRP as well. With XRP, about a billion dollars of XRP goes from escrow into the markets every single month. And that has sort of a distribution curve um, over sort of a long period of time. So when you see these things and see these figures, that's a good thing. It's a good sign when you um, have a look at a project that they have that long-term vision they're not just thinking about the next two years they're thinking about the next 5 10 15 years which is super important um it also has another thing called pure proof of stake so ppos now you have the proof of work and you have proof of stake uh, to just put it very very briefly proof of work unique computers and uh, other sort of algorithms to validate transactions on a blockchain proof of stake you can have different nodes so people staking their their cryptocurrency they can then validate a transaction and pure proof of stake means uh, in this case the more you hold the more you have a chance of being selected to validate a transaction now this is there's an upside and there's a downside the downside is that there could be sort of a split between the people who hold the most and between people who hold um, the least um, but also at the same time the people who hold the most it's also beneficial within themselves um, to make sure that they validate that transaction and they don't act uh, dishonestly which is super important when it comes to validating transactions and other sort of governance protocols on a network so that is super important um, going into the ecosystem it's a big ecosystem that people are building on top of it so you have the likes of italy um, going into it as well uh, for banking and also insurance guarantees. Um, now, this is super important because, you know, regardless of whether it's a government or a corporation, they're looking into the technology of crypto. And regardless of the cryptocurrency, when you see a government or a corporation looking into the benefits of cryptocurrency, that's a big sign that something is going well at the moment. Another thing that was also uh, announced with uh, Algorand is that they've also had a network upgrade recently in this year. So during the bear market, during the crypto winter, Algorand have upgraded their network and continue to upgrade their network as well throughout this crypto winter 
And something I've always said as well, whenever it is the case, whenever you see a project uh, upgrading their network or continuing to develop themselves in the crypto winter, in the bear market, they have that long-term vision. They're not there for the short term, for those short bull markets that you may see from time to time. Now, you can also participate in Algorand governance. That's another thing you can look into. Um, so you can become um, you know, a holder yourself and you can also get a potential APY of 10% to 14%. Um, it's something that we like to look into here at CryptoBusy, always looking into those percentages percentages into those yields that you can look into. Of course, it does come with a lot of risk. You know, do your own research when it comes into those sort of things as well. And, you know, beneficial use cases. This is also a big thing. I think a big thing as to why I think Algorand's going to be taking the world by storm in 2023 and also beyond is the different industries it's in. So uh, unsurprisingly, in my opinion, there's gold trading that it has, um, you know, it has its use case in gold trading. So Meld Gold platform, they've also used the Algorand uh, blockchain itself, which is interesting to see and also the technology. But something I did not expect at all was air quality monitoring. Um, so something that is also super important, especially across a lot of cities across the world, is air quality monitoring. You may notice on your um, phone app, your weather app, it shows the weather quality. There may be Plainwatch, which use also the Algorand technology um, with their air quality monitoring. So some really interesting use cases. And that shows, again, how vast it is used across different industries. That is also a big thing that is going for Algorand. So um, going further into this and also some price predictions and other things and to wrap up this video, um, make sure to check out this uh, interview. Exclusive interview with the Algorand interim uh, CEO, Sean Ford. He says, our time is now. Interesting read. Make sure to check it out. Link down in the description below. Um, in terms of their transactions per second, so their TPS, uh, 14,000 per second, which is a big thing for scalability. So if there were to be um, a currency or a digital currency built on top of this network, it does have the ability to withhold those amounts of transactions um, you know, within the country. Because if you're trying to create a CBDC, in this case, you're going to need to have something that can support and withhold a lot of transactions per second. XRP does it very well. Ethereum could do it very well as well, but also Algorand can do it. Um, and then also recently, um, Coin Bureau was on um, Alcoin Daily, so it's great to see that community uh, interaction with everybody there. Um, he also said that Algorand has uh, is undervalued and has some great ability to do really well in the future. Uh, also make sure to check out that interview. Really interesting stuff that they're talking there. Um, we're also going to be talking um, with Coin Bureau in January of next year. So Josh and I will be in Dubai and, and there'll be a Coin Bureau event there. So make sure to check that out. Um, it will be with talking and be like a fireside chat type of thing uh, with Coin Bureau in January. I believe it is late January. All the details will be announced sooner towards the time. So there, yeah, Algorand. Um, currently trading at around sort of 17 cents. Does it have the ability to go back up to the all-time high? Yes, it does, in my opinion, but it's going to take time. It's not just going to take Algorand and what it does within and of itself. It's also going to take the crypto markets. And importantly, it's going to take the macroeconomic factors that are affecting all of us at the moment. And I don't think that's going to be, you know, sort of over until about Q1 or Q2 of 2024. So it's going to be a difficult 2023, but I do think cryptocurrencies that are building on top of their networks right now, such as Algorand, I think are going to take 2023 by storm. Maybe not in price action, but in terms of partnerships and its impact in the space, I think that's where it's going to really create that impact and take 2023 by storm. But do comment down below whether you agree or disagree what I've said in today's video. Articles that I've gone through in today's video, I'll leave links down in the description below, so you can check it out for yourselves much for the detail. Another thing I want to mention as well, we also have our Crypto Busy Signals group. We put a signal for Algorand, a trade for Algorand, and it done really well. So make sure to check out our signals group on Telegram. Links down in the description below as well. It's completely free, free for everyone to join. And again, that will be linked down in the description below. So if you found this interesting, if you're new here as well, make sure to join the CryptoBusy family today and subscribe. Leave a like on this video. It's very much appreciated. And again, do comment down below your thoughts and opinions. My name is Tom. This is CryptoBusy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.